the um, kickoff celebration for the 2011 Combined Charity Campaign. My name is Shirley Crawford, and I am the manager for the Combined Charity Campaign, and I have been um, on the team with uh, Baltimore City for the past two months, and I have to tell you that I am just so happy and blessed that I can be a part of something that actually has defined a lot of who I am. It is organizations that are here, and it's been employees who have donated over the years that have sustained um, organizations and programs that I have benefited from. So thank you very much for that. Um, I would like to take a moment to um, thank uh, Todd Langenberg, who um, you'll be hearing from just a moment, VP of Development of the United Way of Central Maryland, as well as Quinn Conyers, who uh, was the former uh, manager of the Combined Charity Campaign and actually my supervisor that has been working with me as well. And i like to thank um, everyone who's sitting up on stage with me today um, to support the Combined Charity Campaign. Chief Clack and I have had some wonderful meetings of support with um, them just talking about how we can get you more information to do what you like to do. I'd like to take a moment to uh, thank uh, Rico Singleton, who was the campaign co-chair of the Combined Charity Campaign, as well as Chief Clack, who has been leading me diligently and how he would like to get the message across of how important the work is that we all do in the community. And um, lastly, but not least, I would like to thank my um, connectors with the mayor's office, Mara Blanchard and Kristen Barczak. They have been diligently guiding me as in this beginning endeavor of working with the Combined Charity Campaign. So without further ado, I would like to introduce Madam Mayor Stephanie Rollins Blake. Rico Singleton for their leadership, and I know with their leadership we will top the 1,175,000 that we raised last year with employees, retirees uh, from Baltimore City as well as quasi city agencies. We will exceed this year $1.2 million. And I know we can do it. We have continued the theme Give from the Heart, and as I was coming over here, I those press conferences that you see with uh, Bill and Melinda Gates as they're giving away millions upon millions to all of the organizations and Mayor Bloomberg giving away a million dollars like it's five dollars. And I was thinking to myself, why should the rich people have all the fun? That we can be philanthropists in our own way with what we have when we give from the heart. So I really want you to take a look at all the organizations. They are doing magnificent work all across our city and our state. And with what we have, we can give and show them that we appreciate the work that they're doing, that we want to stand with them as they work sometimes for the least of us in, in our community. So thank you for giving from the heart. Thank you for being here. And for those of you who just came for the free lunch, I want you to give too. So thank you again. I think I'm too much turning this over to, to you, Chief Clark, or my sitting down. I would like to introduce our fire chief, the one who is leading the charge of the combined campaign, Chief Jim Todd. Thank you, Mayor, and, and thank each of you. Uh, I know that, uh, as the Mayor said, it's not the best day out there, but, you know, it's just water. And for firefighters, water's our friend, so it's not a big deal. Thank you for being here. You know, and I've got a little speech prepared, but I'm not going to talk about that. I want to tell you a little story. About um, eight years ago, I had the opportunity to work in a group home for men that are chronically alcoholic. They were men that had been thrown out of the drunk tank, so to speak. They were constantly uh, drinking. Uh, they were basically uh, dying. 
And that experience changed my life when it comes to looking at agencies like these that are here in the room. These people save lives every day. And as city employees, we are blessed. We are blessed with a job, with benefits. Generally, we have a roof over our house, our house, over our family, and we have something to eat. And all you have to do is go right outside here within a block of this building, and you'll find people that are not as fortunate. So I want to challenge each of you, no matter what you make, you can be a leadership donor in this combined charity campaign for $10 a week. And if you can't afford $10 a week, give what you can. But I'm here to challenge you, instead of going to the movies, instead of buying a couple of McDonald's hamburgers, take that $10 a week, $20 a pay, fill out that form, and we'll honor you as a leadership donor. That's $520 over the span of a year. And that sounds like a lot of money, but $10 a week, I think all of us can do that. We've got about 500 city employees right now out of 30,000 of us that do that. I'd love to see us double that number. So that's my challenge to you. Enjoy your lunch, but think about what I said and Take time to visit with all of these outstanding agencies and learn what they do. And really, as the theme of the uh, event says, give from the heart. Thank you. Thank you, Chief Clive. I, um, I had to brag on Chief Clive for just a moment. Um, he really heard the message and felt the message of give from the heart last year. And he went out and diligently worked with um, Captain Charlene Stokes to get everyone at the fire department to really feel the passion of what it means to get from the heart and increase their campaign by um, $60,000 last year. That needs to be a So thank you. Um, so we're going to have uh, Todd Langenberg come up from uh, United Way of Central Maryland to say a few words. And Madam Mayor and Chief, thank you very much for allowing us to be able to partner on behalf of the United Way for decades now with the city of Baltimore. It's something that we do with enthusiasm and something that for us is not only an honor, but something that we take very seriously. The Combined Charity Campaign is an integral part of our organization. And in just the past 10 years alone, the Combined Charity Campaign has raised almost $12 million to be able to contribute back into this community. And it's all because of your generosity and your efforts every year. And we have a lot to be proud of Baltimore. $12 million is something that the nonprofit organizations around the room can't survive without that support. And in these tremendously trying times that we've had lately, either because of the weather or we reflect back on this Sunday, the 10 year anniversary of 9 11, we've all been able to see difficult moments personally, in our families, in our neighborhoods. And what's been important is we've come together to care for one another, to provide kindness, to provide support. And I've asked on behalf of United Way and all of the charities that as you go out there, that you don't just ask for that gift, but you ask for people to remember what it's for, what this is all about, to be able to take care of one another, whether you know them or don't know them. Because on behalf of the Combined Charity Campaign, your efforts, your front line, what makes a difference. As we uh, do remember on Sunday and reflect on things, I know my wife and I will take a moment to remember those that we lost, whether it's friends from growing up, whether it's high school friends, college friends, or such. Um, we want to make sure that we don't remember them, but honor them as well. So as we kick off this campaign, I want to challenge all of you to be able to carry that enthusiasm, that passion of giving and caring and kindness for everyone around you. So I thank you for your partnership with United Way. I thank you for your role in the Combined Charity Campaign, and I wish everyone success on this year's 2011 campaign. Thank you. Thank you very much, Todd. Um, 
Todd has always been a, a wonderful leader within the organization, and I've been happy to work with him um, over the past four years um, with United Way, and I'm excited that I was given the opportunity to do this uh, to do this job. So. What it means to give from the heart is to really dig down deep and, and be excited about what you're doing. I give from the heart because of this reason. I give from the heart because of that reason. I want to make sure that I'm doing what I need to do in the community. Well, I can tell you that um, I've learned in my short time here that you definitely need to have a strong team behind you, guiding you and helping you along the way. And um, this past week of doing the trainings, I see some familiar faces with the coordinators who attended yesterday, as well as some familiar faces with the charities who attended on Wednesday, that um, I couldn't have done it without the support from the 14 loaned executives that had been assigned uh, to work with me during the campaign um, of, the, of 2011. And I just want to have everyone stand up they're all here on the front row. They have come in and we have shown them so many wonderful things and most importantly, we've shown them why they are important and an integral part to this organization. Um, of course, this year moving forward, we definitely want to have um, a 50% participation rate. That's only a small, inching, just small uh, amount to raise because we're at 32% as a, a city. And um, they're going to be working diligently to make sure that we reach 100% ads. That everyone that works within Baltimore City will know that they have the opportunity to do what they want to do with their money and their organization and helping their organization. I also would like to take a moment to thank all of the loaned executives that are here and they're moving around the room um, from the Maryland Charity Campaign. They have been um, willing to come out and help and, and guide us through today as well, so please give them a hand also. Okay, so um, if you're an employee, get your ticket. Lunch is downstairs. Please, you will not be able to eat up here. Lunch will be served in um, just a moment, but make sure you take a moment to um, spend some time with the 80 charities that are here representing um, the 319 charities that are listed in the directory. So thank you very much, and welcome to the kickoff of the 2011 Combined Charity Campaign.